Here we have three tablespoons of ghee or melted butter, um, around 35 grams. We have two cups of maida or flour, it would be around 300 grams. And here we have one teaspoon of javan and one teaspoon of salt. I need one water to the link. No, to put in maida. To put in maida. So first of all, we'll add maida. Elisa will take maida and put it inside, right? Like this. We add maida. Yeah. Now we mix. No, not yet. Then we will add uh, one teaspoon of javan yeah. and one teaspoon of salt inside. Now we mix. Not yet. And now we will add melted ghee or melted butter. Now we make. Now we mix. Now we'll mix it with our hand ah, till it becomes like a sand texture. Not wet and not dry. Just squeezing it between your fingers. Inside the water. water. Just put it slowly, pour it slowly, till the dough will be formed. And we'll keep it aside for uh, 20 or 30 minutes. Let's uh, cover it with a towel or a plastic wrap. Now our dough is almost ready. We'll just make it. So I'll take it out on a clean surface and I'll just try to wound it more. Our dough is ready and I like to divide it into three parts. So mostly I use pizza cutter and then I'll just make balls out of it. Already balls are looking like this and now we'll roll one by one and prepare them for prank. Now let's roll this one into a very thin circle. For me it never works as a circle. Or this is just some different kind of shape. We don't need anything to dust. No atta or anything. Butter it makes not sticky. Kuchnichi. Just a bit of power. Well now okay, I rolled it. Now I'll cut it with pizza cutter because it's quite easy than uh, with knife. I rolled it quite thin as well, you can see. Thinner than roti. Now let's cut it. Just pick it up like this one by one or with knife. I like to pick it up with this, it's quite easy, and then we will be frank. I put a stove on a medium heat and wait till the oil will become quite hot. Before putting namak paras for frying, they are stick together. Here, I moved the spoon that they would get separated. You should fry namak pare till they become golden brown. Before taking them out, I put a paper towel on the tray. It absorbs the oil from namak pare, so they are not that oily. Something for you. Hi. Look. Namak pare. You want to taste? Yeah. Are you happy? How is it? Mm. You like it? Yeah. 
Can I do We just came out for a walk. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe. And press the like button. And press the like button. I'll make a more videos for you. I love it.